Good morning. I hope you all got some amazing prayer in this morning. Um, my morning didn't go as planned, <laughs> but it's okay. It's still going really good. I still got up. I still got some prayer in. Um, I started praying and then my daughter woke up way earlier than I anticipated. So it's cutting my alone prayer time a little bit shorter than I had hoped, but it's okay. I still got like 30-ish minutes in and I'm gonna go get her and then try to pray some more with her. So we will see. I thought I was gonna have like a lot of extra time because normally they don't wake up this early. We're figuring it out as we go. So don't feel bad. Don't be discouraged if your morning didn't go as planned. Just try again tomorrow, make adjustments if you need to and keep trying. You guys, I went to bed so late. <laughs> I totally messed myself up there. I I don't think I fell asleep till two-ish. And then I woke up at five, like every 10 minutes until six it felt like because I think I was worried that I had turned off my alarm and that I didn't remember what time I set the alarm for. So I, I didn't get very much sleep. <laughs> so after I get my daughter, I'm gonna make a coffee. But first, don't forget to drink your water in the morning. I cleaned my front room to make sure it was ready for me to pray in the morning. I did not clean the toy room because I can't see it from over there. <laughs> so we'll do this later. Good morning. Are you stuck? Oh, are you stuck? Do you need help? You want to get out, huh? Oh, look at your hair. <laughs> okay, let me get a hair tie. Hey! You need a hair tie. You gotta put your hair up. Yeah, thank you. Praise the Lord for coffee. Yes. Yes, Lord. It's already almost eight and I haven't gotten to back to trying to pray again with my daughter because I had to change her, make her some food. I made myself a coffee and <laughs> she um, has had a lot of requests. Sorry, she's right here. So. I'm gonna need more time tomorrow. I'm gonna need to get up earlier. Yes? to rush out the door. I have my women's small group at church, but I just wanted to say, I hope you got some good prayer in. I am praying for you guys. Um, some of you have shared things you're going through and I'm adding you to my prayer list by name. Um, I wanna go over our verse of the day and talk about it for a quick second. And I am totally enjoying chatting with you guys in the comments. So definitely keep that up. Thank you so much. And yeah, I mean, today didn't go as planned for me because my daughter woke up a lot earlier. Um, so I didn't get as much time as I would hope. So tomorrow I'm gonna get up a little bit earlier and just adjust as I go. Do not be discouraged if your day did not go as planned. It's okay, just try again tomorrow and make your adjustments. The verse of the day is 2 Corinthians 12, eight through 10. 
Three times I begged the Lord to take it away. Each time he said, my grace is all you need. My power works best in weakness. So now I am glad to boast about my weakness so that the power of Christ can work through me. That's why I take pleasure in my weakness and in the insults, hardships, persecutions, and troubles that I suffer for Christ. For when I am weak, then I am strong. You don't need to wait until you have it all together, until you're perfect for God to use you. If you feel weak, if you feel tired, if you feel exhausted, if you feel inadequate, underqualified, uneducated, all the things, then you are in the perfect place, my friend, to be used by God because his power works best in our weakness. We don't need to try to do it on our own. We don't need to wait until we're cleaned up. And you might feel like you don't know how to start conversations or you don't know how to minister to people or you don't know that much of the Bible yet. It's okay, tell your testimony. There's so much power in our testimony. Tell where you've been to where you are now. Anything God has done in your life, share it. Nobody can dispute what God has done for you. I shared one of my favorite songs, which is Monday Morning Faith. I thought it was you know, fitting. I hope you enjoyed this vlog style. I'm going to be doing some different things with the videos throughout the week, but thank you for being a part of my day. Thank you for doing this with me. I got some texts with testimonies and I'm just so excited to be doing this with you all. My husband found out he had to stay late at work and so I was gonna have to miss my group and my mom came to save the day, which is so sweet. So she's gonna watch my kids while I go for a little bit, which is a much needed little break. Side note, look, my sister-in-law got me this Bible and it is so beautiful, you guys. I love it so much. Talk to you all tomorrow.